First tonight, new video takes us inside an undercover operation at the Westfield Brandon Mall, where two armed suspects tried to rob a Hillsborough County deputy. One of those suspects later started shooting, but thankfully no one was hurt. The sheriff's office says that undercover deputy was trying to buy guns to get them off the streets. ABC Action News reporter Julie Salomon joins us live near the mall. And Julie, there's still a manhunt for one of those suspects. Yeah, Jameson and the sheriff's office says they have identified that second suspect. They know who they are looking for. They're obviously still searching for him tonight. All of this taking place in the parking lot behind me. One of the suspects opened fire. Deputies did not return fire and luckily no one was hurt. Action Air One flew over the Westfield Brandon Mall after a suspect started shooting at deputies in the mall parking lot Monday afternoon. Orange markers indicate evidence. We saw a handgun on the sidewalk outside the Cheesecake Factory. And we've got to get these guns off the street and prevent them from getting into the hands of individuals like these subjects today. The Hillsborough County Sheriff's Office releasing video of what led up to the shooting near the Cheesecake Factory and Macy's. A suspect who was standing outside the vehicle pointed a gun at the undercover detective and robbed him while another suspect sat inside the car. The Sheriff's Office says an undercover detective was posing as a buyer, trying to purchase guns from the two suspects in an effort to get those guns off the street. We had detectives who are monitoring the transaction, moved in, lights and sirens, in an effort to make sure there was no harm to our detective. The sheriff's office says the suspects ran away. One of them fired off at least five rounds. The bullet struck cars in the parking lot, but no one was hurt. Deputies arrested 19-year-old Jordan Gracia. The sheriff's office says he has a lengthy criminal history with at least 26 felony charges. The second suspect got away. The sheriff's office explains why the transaction was done in a public place like a mall. We've got to make sure that there's units close enough so if something like this happens tonight, we can be there and move in and protect our officers. We would love to do it out in an open field in the middle of somewhere, but I fear if we did that, our, our deputy would be dead. And this shooting happened around 4 o'clock in the afternoon, so the mall closed early. It is expected to reopen tomorrow morning. Reporting live in Hillsborough County, Julie Salomon, ABC Action News. And you'll keep monitoring the search for that suspect for us. Julie, thank you.